And I'm Jalisa. Thanks for tuning in to Weber TV News. This year at Weber celebrated for the first time is Queer Day, where various guests come to visit Weber to share their background and careers with students on March 8th. Let's go take a look. Today is March 8th and it's Career Day. We got a whole bunch of wonderful, talented people coming into our school, Weber Media Arts Academy, joining us in this building to tell us about themselves and their career. So I'm going to be you guys' host and see you. But I did a lot of online classes and a lot of um, what they call non-traditional alternative routes to education. So I do hold two bachelor's degrees, two master's degrees, an a specialist degree and a doctorate at the doctorate level. And what I like about Career Day is it's like, like the professional people, they like come come inside like a, like our school, you know, just like help us on like like who we want to be when we grow up. Welcome back. Now we go over to our reporter Tierra as she speaks with Miss Benjamin, our teacher of the month. Hi, I'm Tierra, and I'm here with Miss Benjamin, and she is the teacher of the month. And I'm, I have a certificate for her. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Let me start off with some questions. Okay. So, how does it feel to be the teacher of the month? I'm very excited. You know, this is new. We never had teacher of the month, so I'm I'm honored. This is great. What inspired you to become a teacher and why? Hmm. Um, I had some really awesome teachers growing up, but I also had some teachers that weren't so great and who made me feel like I wasn't good enough. So I made it that point to never, I never want to make a kid feel that way. So I became a teacher, you know, to inspire learning and to get kids excited about education. And that was like the main reason why I became a teacher, was to help kids love education. Yeah, that's <laughs> What's your favorite movie? Oh. My favorite movie, so many. We were just talking about this. I think my favorite movie would have to be, oh, Wonder. I just saw that recently, and I think that's a good movie for all ages, and it has a really great story behind it. Thank you for talking with me today. Thank you. Enjoy being a teacher of the month. Well, thank you very much. <laughs> Congrats, Ms. Benjamin. It looks like we also have a student of the month. Let's go to reporter Deanna in her story. Hi, my name is Deanna, and I have here with me is Ryan, and she is one of the students of the month this year. So, Ryan, how do you, what do you do on your free time? I'll call one of my friends. I will <clears throat> I'll watch you too, or I will eat. So, how do you prepare yourself for school? I'll listen to my teacher. I'll follow directions and I'll do my work. I have a certificate for you and I created it. Thanks for being here with us and you're watching Weber TV. Congrats to you, Ryan, for Student of the Month. Now let's head over to our next story. Hi, this is Carolyn reporting live. Last week at Weber Media Arts Academy, we celebrated Black History Month with our Heritage Program, where students and teachers perform different acts for our parents. We have with us Denyla, who was one of the performers in the program. Denyla, what was your role in this year's Heritage Program, and what did you like about it most? My role was to join a truth anti-women poem. And what I liked about it most was how everyone looked up to me. The little girls, the grown women, and it was just beautiful. Well, that's awesome. We'll be back to you guys in the studio. 
It's your anchor, Denial Angelisa. Thank you for watching Weber TV. See you back next time.